Is it just that one of these harps was put in the dryer? Hi, I'm Barbara. I'm a harpist and entrepreneur who helps students of various ages and levels learn to play the harp. Before I go any further, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon to be notified of my videos when they post on Tuesdays. Okay, so what's the difference between this plethora of harps I'm sitting among? This is not the largest harp there is, but it's a pedal harp, and pedal harps do come a bit bigger than this. And these two harps are lever harps. Now, what's the difference between a pedal harp and a lever harp? Well, a lever harp uses the, um, a lever to change into accidentals. And a pedal harp uses a pedal. I will insert a picture here of what the pedal harp looks like uh, down near the feet. That's where the pedals are. Now, is one of these for professional? Um, like, do you start on the lever harp and move up to a pedal harp? Not necessarily. There are professional harpers. That's what we often call people who play the harp that doesn't have pedals. Um, this is often um, compared to a Celtic harp. Lever harps are generally smaller and more portable. Um, there are larger lever harps like this one, which um, resembles a pedal harp. And you'll also see that some lever harps are fully levered, like this one, meaning that they have a lever on each string, and some are just have levers on some strings, like this one. What type of harp you'd like to use depends on the needs of you as a harpist. In terms of price, Generally, pedal harps are more expensive than lever harps. Also note that there are some harps that don't have levers at all, like this sweet little lap harp. I hope that was helpful in learning a little bit of a difference between different types of harps. If you like that, be sure to subscribe to my channel, and don't forget to click the bell to be notified when I upload new videos. Until next time, thumbs up!